few years ago, I got a number of questions about oil of oregano. It turned out that it was because a gentleman by the name of Dr. Cass Igram had been on the radio and had been touting the benefits of oil of oregano. It cured everything from allergies to zits. So I got questions about this, uh, especially because he had been a guest on the same radio station that hosts my show. So I started to look into it, and it turned out that it was the usual sort of natural silliness uh, claims that oil of oregano was the cure for every disease known to mankind. And as we know, the more claims made on behalf of a substance, the less likely that any of them are true. So anyway, I passed off Dr. Igram as uh, ah, sort of a, a flake, even though he did have a degree in osteopathic medicine. And I forgot about him for years. But very recently, I had another question uh, about oil of oregano, and I thought, you know, maybe I should look into whether or not this guy has updated his information. So I started to look. Well, it turns out that the book indeed has been updated, but interestingly enough, his name is spelled differently. Now there is an N in there. He's become Dr. Cass Ingram. Well, that looked a bit bizarre to me because I didn't think that a publisher was going to make that mistake, get their name spelling wrong. So this uh, precipitated uh, a deeper dive into Dr. Cass Ingram or Ingram. And it turned out that he had a number of videos out there where he was identified as Dr. Cass Ingram, this time with an N. And he was talking about natural remedies, uh, mostly uh, without any kind of scientific evidence, but he was kind of well-spoken. And anyway, I come across another set of videos. But this time, he was not Dr. Cass Ingram. He was Dr. Kasim Khalil. And uh, he was talking about totally different things. He wasn't talking about natural remedies. Now he was talking about how Islam is misunderstood. And he was talking about various kind of conspiracy theories. And it turned out that he had even written a book that I tracked down. Here it is, wrongly blamed. And it was all about how 9-11 and the uh, Boston Marathon bombings and London bombings were actually a conspiracy organized by Mossad, the Israeli secret uh, service. And uh, it turned out that he was also a guest on a number of radio shows Whereas Dr. Kasim Khalil, or as Dr. K, he was propounding all of these conspiracy theories. And the more I looked into him, the more obnoxious his comments turned out to be. Turned out he was also a Holocaust denier. But there was this alter side of his personality where he was talking about the natural health products. So how often do we find someone uh, whose least objectionable comments uh, ones about uh, the frivolity of natural health products. So this was pretty disturbing kind of thing, uh, taking the deep dive into this guy and finding that there's a lot more to him uh, than just proposing uh, that natural health remedies are, are the answer to all of life's problems. I have looked more into oil of oregano and uh, certainly it is not the answer to all of life's problems. There is basically no scientific evidence that it does anything except maybe make your pizza taste a lot better. Uh, there's one last little bit about this that I dug up, and that is that oil of oregano uh, is a pretty good repellent for a certain type of cockroach.